Hello there, I'm Mike Russell from MusicRadioCreative.com. In this video, I will show you how to use the fantastic Melodyne auto-tuning plugin right inside Adobe Audition. So here we are in Adobe Audition with some sung vocals. I have previously demonstrated to you in other videos how to go into effects, time and pitch, automatic pitch correction, do a bit of extreme correction to get close to T-Pain. Brain smashing, mind blowing. As you can see, a little bit of auto-tune going on there. But if you want to use Melodyne, a fantastic pro plugin, it works right inside Adobe Audition as an audio unit on Mac or a VST3 if you're using the PC. Ceremony, Melodyne right there. If it's not appearing, audio plugin manager, scan for plugins should bring it right inside Audition. So now let's go and fire up Celemony Melodyne so I can do a bit of auto-tuning uh, with this sung vocal. There it is, you see, as a panel inside Adobe Audition. First thing I would do is click Transfer. Uh, if I don't click Transfer, if I play, Brain smashing, mind blowing. you see nothing appears inside Melodyne. When I click Transfer, you're going to see that this will transfer now in. Brain smashing, mind blowing. Perfect. And as soon as it finishes transferring, you notice there it analyzed the sung vocals very quickly and it's given me some notes there. So now I can just pull those notes around to wherever I want them to be, maybe all to be the same note, uh, which will be a clear auto-tune. Uh, and then play it back in audition, you'll hear the auto-tuned version. Brain smashing, mind blowing. Bra brain smashing, mind blowing. And of course, you can mess about and uh, do all kinds of things uh, with this auto tuning plugin. Brain smashing, mind blowing. <laughs> you can see, you can have some fun with it uh, by totally distorting and disrupting lyrics. But really, Melodyne is fantastic for auto tuning any kind of audio. Melodyne will work as a VST or audio unit plugin in any of your favorite audio editing uh, digital audio workstations. So go ahead, give it a go with your favorite workstation, and let me know how you get on in the comments to this video.